Hi everyone, here I am back with a channel message from Pluto, the sentient being who is a smaller planet in our solar system. And you know, astrologically right now, Pluto is, you know, pretty dramatic in our <laughs> astrologically. So, um, there we kind of have mystery surrounding pluto what it really means what pluto would say about itself oh hi laurie so this was um joe g who asked can you channel pluto so i checked in and yes indeed pluto came through and it was a powerful message uh that i really couldn't wait to share actually so Pluto is an aspect of divine source, as we are all many aspects of divine source, uh, but Pluto is this bigger sentient being. It brings destruction and transformation, trauma and shadow work, mind work, you know, the mind script, the negative mind script, control and power struggles to the surface so we can work on them. Hi, hi Janet, hi Bora, Bora. <laughs> you guys are cute. So um, with all that in mind, now we're going to hear how Pluto frames itself and what the gifts are that Pluto brings, which is amazingly fascinating and wonderful. So I really love the energy that I got from Pluto. And, um, you know, I want to share that with you here. So begin transmission. I am Pluto and for eons of time eons of time i have been the talk of lore i am simply a planet a being of divine source an aspect bringing the gifts of divine sentience this gift allows you to feel to become sensitive to all imagine you are the only being on a planet and then imagine eons of time go by Suddenly, you are surrounded by other sentient beings. You want to connect, but alas, those beings do not see you. You are invisible to them. This is mankind's unawakened state. So, beloveds, I come to awaken within you those feelings, those connections to life, and all sentient beings in the multiverse. For, beloveds, it is time to reawaken to your God selves. That, of course, is about opening to the divine oneness within you all. That is the connection I seek and the gift I bring to you all. Can you allow it? Can you? Yes. Will you allow this connection? This connection is within your own soul the very connection that tethers you to your God self within. I ask you to open your feeling centers and allow the conscious connection to me now. You will find a ready mirror and a deep love underneath your self blocks that were set up before you came into this earth life. This is simple illusion and you are actually a complete and whole divine light, God, source. This is a gift of viewing the very inside of yourself. And that, my beloveds, is the crystalline gift I bring you. Connect with me through your loving heart. Let go of illusionary blocks and fears and limitations, for they are not needed any longer in this third density, now becoming fifth density. Beloveds, I am you, you are me. Let us connect to the oneness that is the God source. We are delighted to bring this message to you and greater gifts will unfold for you as you tune in and connect with the frequencies. So release and receive, beloveds. I am Pluto, as you have so named me. 
I am in the oneness with you all, beloveds. Until we talk again, I bid you goodbye. End of transmission. And I wanted to put this in here because I notice you, we're going to do the next one after this, and the transmission is Maitreya. And I noticed that as we practice some of these things, it automatically brings up things for releasing. So practice the violet flame. Use the violet flame for burning away old energies as they come up for release. So visualize yourself standing. Just, I mean, we're talking big stuff. Stand in a violet flame. Just imagine it coming up from Earth. Just you're standing in it. So uh, imagine it is evaporating all the old blocks and energy no longer serving you in, in your highest timeline for your highest good, greater good of all. Imagine the violet flame is just evaporating at all. However that works for you, um, that is a powerful, powerful thing that St. Germain brought for, for us to use. So um, do that. So with all of these practices I'm talking about today, the violet flame is an important aspect as you connect, as you release blocks, all this work you're doing afterwards, boom, do that violet flame. Do it before and after. Do it five times a day. It's all good. But uh, I find it very powerful. And um, I just have one more transmission that I'm going to come back with in a few minutes. And that is a really powerful, powerful one uh, with an, an amazing amazing information that we need um, from Ascended Master Maitreya uh, Buddha. So, <laughs> okay. Oh, you guys are so cute. So Janet, Bora Bora, um, Sharon, Richie, <laughs> thank you all for being here in like in two seconds, you guys. <laughs> Sharon, oh my gosh, you guys are cute. So, in a few minutes, I'll be back with the third and final channeling for today. And I think a super powerful one. So um, hang on to your hats for this one. I'll be back in a few minutes. I love you all. Bye-bye. <laughs>